All right, I'm gonna see if I can do this and give an explanation for what I'm doing. Uh, first thing I've done, gone through and loosened all the all, all the all the screws. I've got a piece here that I have drawn a line on. I cut a piece over the cutter uh, at my 3.666, and then I drew a pencil line. So I'm setting this cutter just to the waist side, the side, the, trying to hit the edge where that piece of paper was. So now I've got this one tight where I want it. I'm gonna grab this one and I'm gonna bring it over. I'm going to squeeze this so the rubber pops out a little bit and grabs that piece of paper better. And then I'm gonna set this bottom one. This is the mandrel that it's going to perk against. I've got it set right underneath the blade. You can see the blade, you can see the mandrel. We're gonna set the mandrel here in just a moment because we're gonna tighten this one, this one right here that you can't apparently see. We're gonna tighten this one down. And once we get that one tightened down, we're going to then turn around and tighten this one over here. And then I'm going to take a larger one. I'm going to stick it in between these two. I'm going to pull that way, which will push all the rollers that way and tighten up or bulge out that rubber disc right there. Do that that rubber disc has a bulge in it we're going to go ahead and bring this up we're going to tighten this one down bulge that rubber disc out and we're just going to tighten that up where it is i think we already tightened that one now we're going to do the same up here we're going to go ahead and tighten that one in and put this in here push it over a little bit give it some bulge and then we're going to somewhat continue that process Across the face here. We're going to loosen. We may think about this. We're going to go ahead and start over here. Tighten this one up where it is. We're going to then tighten this one tight. We're going to tighten this one for the moment. Then we're going to put pressure. Press that one. Tighten that one. This one. We're going to go the other way and tighten that one. So now all of these soft rubber pieces have a bulge in them. Now we're going to do the same thing across the bottom, more or less. We've got to make sure we have enough room to do that. Or even if we need to do that, we may just be able to lock these down down here. That one, that one's locked, that one's locked. That won't matter because it'll be all right. We're just gonna bulge this one out and call it good. All right, now we've got that all taken care of. We're gonna take our paper, paper pieces out of the gauge steps and we're gonna put in the blue green one because I have changed that around. Let me get this here, okay? Without getting my ugly face in the picture. 